Thinking differently to raise fit kids can be a bit complicated. Here are just a few pointers to ensure success. This is Chris, your friendly neighborhood fitness man, and this is Get Fit Now. Take it easy. Today, because we are talking about children, I decided to ask a child expert to come on this panel today and help me out with a couple of questions that I know that we all need answered. She has helped me over the years to understand children really well and actually helped me to be a better parent. Thank you for being with us today, Jewel. You're welcome. So let's get to it. I'm gonna ask this young lady, the child expert, a couple of questions that only a child would know the answer to. All right, so Jewel, what is it that children really want from their relationship with their parents? Uh, they want the love that everyone wants. Unconditional love, right? Mm -hmm. I think everybody wants unconditional love. Yes. Kind of like to be heard, understood, and respected. Mm -hmm. Hit me high. Evacuate. Evacuate. So, even when somebody disagrees with you, you still think there should be unconditional love? Yes. Especially then, right? Mm -hmm. Moving on. Unconditional love, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, unconditional love. Unconditional love, even when the parent is upset, right? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Okay, are you absolutely sure? I'm positively sure. Okay, okay. <laughs> so, even when the parent is upset, there should still be unconditional love. My next question would be, what does that actually look like? Because sometimes when parents are adulting, they get in the middle of their thing and they're not thinking so clearly. Sometimes how to do that becomes a mystery. So what is it really unconditional love even when you're upset? What does that look like? Like, you're, you look mad on the outside, but in the inside you still, like, you still love your child. Yeah, I completely understand that. Because I think you've seen me a couple of times where I haven't looked exactly happy, have I? <laughs> <laughs> you weren't supposed to agree with that. Okay, but anyway, so acting upset on the outside, but still having respect, right? Yes. And why is having respect important? Because, like, you could get mad at your kid, but you don't want to hurt their feelings, because then they'll get mad at you and have bad influence. That's why you get paid the big bucks. Hold up. Wait a minute. I got a question right here. Oh, so you didn't think I was coming to the party? What are you talking about? Don't act stupid, MacGyver. My alarm clock didn't go off. Anything could have caused that. Pfft. Anything. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Well, the, the power to my apartment was cut. My doorway was barricaded. And my windows were nailed shut. That is a bit more intentional. I don't really think we had anything to do with that. Nope. Nope. Negatory. Just go ahead and ask your question, okay? Okay, honeydew. This is my question. It's my house, these are my rules, and this is my show. How do you deal with that? Listen to me, Papa Bear. You're not gonna mess with this Care Bear. Okay, now before this gets out of hand, let's send Captain Sunshine back to his corner. I was hungry anyway. I'm out. Bye. So, as you saw here, our self-control influences children in a major way. So it's important in dealing with our children to always remember unconditional love and to lead by example by being respectful at all times. Not necessarily happy, but respectful. Mm -hmm. okay. You can still be mad, but you have to control yourself. I have to control myself? But I, I, I have to control my... Okay, all right, I will. <laughs> <laughs> so this will create an emotionally safe environment for the kids. They seek healthy things in the world and they become fit in every way. I'd like to thank you for coming out and helping me out once again, because you helped me out in so many ways. You're welcome. Love in all of its forms is what holds this life together. When our actions speak love, everything works better. Work from love in your home and you'll create miracles. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and make sure to share this video. And please press the subscribe button. And always remember, the power to change is within us all. And when you realize that power, anything in life is possible. I'll see you next time on Get Fit Now. Take care. Take it easy.